Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to reinvest dividends using Robinhood application. So first of all, of course, you would like to go and download Robinhood application if you don't have it on your phone. Of course, you can do that through Play Store if you're using an Android, App Store if you're using an iPhone, or any other store you could be possibly using. Then you would like to go and sign in to create your account. Of course, if you already have an account, just ignore all of that, look and enter your account, and let's just get straight into the tutorial. So here, uh, let me just, uh, as you can see here, I have a PIN code that I have to enter. And of course, if it's your first time using the application, they will not ask you to enter a PIN code because it's my of course uh, the second time you open the application they will ask you to set a pin code for me i set it just as four zeros so here as you can see this will be actually your home slash main screen and here of course you can start you can't start using the application properly if you didn't verify and add fud funds to your account for me i didn't do that i don't have all the options available so i can't like actually do whatever i want in this application but for you if you want to reinvest divins uh, uh, sorry i mean dividends all you need to do just go and here go to your account by clicking at your icon here at the bottom right corner then all you need to do here add the investing option as you can see for me uh, if you click like at the eye icon you can read here everything about the investing and even the reinvesting so let's just go and click at the x so of course for you if you already verified as i said your account and add some funds here you'll have more other options not like me like that so if if you of course uh, verify your account and add funds all you need to do by after clicking your account just click here at invest and you will be even able to click on that then in the dividend reinvestment section select enable dividend reinvestment then toggle the switch on of course you will have everything here and if prompted if if prompted so all you need to do then just complete the onboarding process and you'll be good to go so that will be actually for the tutorial i hope you like it thanks for watching and goodbye